testing that is being done at the Kotoka International Airport is not a PCR test. I think we've had time to explain this over and over again. It's not a PCR test. It's an antigen test. Both the PCR test and the antigen tests help you to um, come to the identification of the COVID-19 virus uh, within the um, body or within the samples or fluids that you have taken. But they take different routes. That is why um, the PCR test is cheaper but may take a longer while to get there. And then the antigen test appears comparatively to be more expensive, but it is faster. So that we don't have to either hold you in a hotel for about 48 hours where you spend some more money, uh, where you are also at risk of, if you are positive, passing it on to other people. And the test is being uh, provided uh, with the support of a private organization that has been contracted by the Ghana Airport Company Limited to provide that test. Um, the test is not being run by Noguchi. Um, we are not aware of any, may I say, tensions at um, Noguchi because of this or tests that are being run by other labs across the country. Remember that uh, over and over again since March during this COVID period, we've been explaining to you our various testing uh, labs across the country, the technology they are using, and the fact that uh, Professor William Ampofo of Noguchi is the one that is coordinating or is, may I say, superintending this entire testing mechanism. Uh, our checks at um, Noguchi do not reveal that there are any tensions there because this is a test, uh, more or less, this is one other lab or one additional lab, and like all of the other labs, it doesn't portend any challenge uh, for our colleagues at um, Noguchi. Uh, even in spite of the particular technology that they are uh, using.